Fill a fago bottom candy reviews. Fill a fago bottom eats lots of candy. Fill a fago bottom candy reviews. Fill a bit of candy reviews. Eat candy. Fill a fago bottom candy. Lots of reviews. Fill a fago bottom reviews. Yeah, yeah. La da 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 fago bottom candy review. La da 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 da. Hello everyone! Hey, it's Philip Figglebottom here coming to you with a candy review. And I have a very special guest. This is my friend John. Hi. He's come today to review. We have more Oreo cookies. They just keep pumping these things out. Um, so we're at the end of summertime, the beginning of fall time. And these cookies kind of represent that. Um, the first ones we're going to try are root beer float. Root beer float cookies. Oreos. The golden Oreo cookies and the cream looks like it's a half and half brown and white. Root beer float Oreos. And the second one we're going to do is caramel apple for the beginning of fall. We've got these root beer float Oreo cookies to kind of celebrate the end of summertime. It's upon us. It's sad. It was, it was a good summer. I don't know. How was your summer? Uh, it was really, uh, really hot. Yeah. Well... Nothing better to cool you down with a root beer float. Now, root beer floats are generally a root beer soda in a giant mug with ice cream. Yes. Right? Vanilla ice cream. Vanilla ice cream and root beer, generally. Do you like root beer floats? Uh, no. No? <laughs> I have no interest in root beer floats. Just a real but one. But I, I do, I am curious what it tastes like in cookie form. Maybe that's okay. my mind. But you've had it before, so. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. It smells like root beer. Like, wow. Really strong root beer. Oh, God. That's <laughs> that's quite amazing. That's like one of those old root beer mm -hmm. barrels. That's what it's Oh, like. yes. Yeah. Root beer barrels are a very good hard candy shaped like a root beer barrel. All right. All right. So this, I mean, it's a golden Oreo cookie. The cream inside is brown and white. I guess one side's for root beer and one side is for the float, the ice cream pot. Yeah, yeah. Look at that. All I right. just, I'm surprised at the smell. It's so strong. You ready to go for it? Yeah, I'll start. Okay. Uh, I'm going to eat the cream first. Because we all know what these taste like. Oh my. That is really strong. And it's... almost like nauseously strong. Right? Yeah. I don't think you can handle it, for everyone. Oh, I just feel like I just ate crackers right before someone shot root beer paste down my mouth. It's weird. Yeah. It's really, really strong. I'm... So far, I think these are the most sickening sweet, strongest flavored Oreo cookies I've had. It really sticks to the teeth. Yes. It's super strong. I, the root beer flavor kind of smacks you in the face and then stabs you in the back and, like, beats you up and leaves you for dead. It's really strong. It's hor horrifying. I, I, <laughs> so I don't know what to think. I, I don't know what much. to think of that. I can only eat one. Usually I do two, but... Mm -mm. Oh. These Oreo cookies are awful. Mm. A real well, soda jerk came up with that one. <laughs> this one here's got jokes. No, these root beer float Oreo cookies. It's part of a line of the these. Yeah. They did the limeade and they did fruit punch over the summer. They did drink like summertime drinks. I heard limeade was pretty good. Limeade's delicious. Yeah. I couldn't get enough limeade. Yeah. Well, everybody, that one is root beer float Oreos. Um, we'll be right back. Um. Enjoy this intermission, and then we'll get to part two of these caramel apple Oreo cookies. I think I need a palate cleanser because those things are just, oh, they're a little gross. They're, they're, um, actually, very gross. Oh. He can't survive it. Okay, everyone, hold tight. We'll be right back. <laughs>
goodness. Welcome back. How was that in a mission? Wonderful. Did you enjoy that? I had a great time. Yes, it's so great. Well, after the root beer float fiasco that was just disgusting. <laughs> it sucked. It's so awful. We're going to bring in the fall. Here we are. It's time for the fall and pumpkins and delicious things. The leaves are changing to cool weather. It's great. So we've got these caramel apple Oreos new for the season. Um, I've got both. I think this is a Target only. I'm, I think there are other ones I found just anywhere. Actually, no. A friend, Matt. Matt Casella gave me root beer for oh, wow, Oreos. Yes. He found them at a grocery store. I think Safeway. Oh, by oh, him. Matt, so thank you, you very much. <laughs> they were disgusting. And I love you. Okay. All right, here we go. Caramel apple Oreos. Once again, they're the golden Oreos. Oh yeah. Ooh, oh. that's a, a lot better smelling. Wow. It's it's very strong caramel. Caramel. Some I... people say caramel, and those people are wrong. What do you say? I say caramel. Caramel. Mm -hmm. Very nice, fancy. Okay, this one also has a two tone cream, green and brown, caramel and apple. Now, I foresee this having a very strong caramel flavor because of the smell. Yeah. Let's do it. Uh, uh, uh. Um, oh. It's a lot of chemical flavors. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I believe I cleaned a pool with this one. It's strong chemicals. Once you get past the chemicals, it's quite delicious. <laughs> It's so strong, it's super strong flavor of, I mean the caramel is really strong, and the apple too. They're both kind of fighting to be dominant. This one's going into a diabetic coma. It's very sweet. Mm. It's, so, <laughs> it's so sweet. I'm sorry, John. Fuck. You're reacting more to this one than the root beer, and the root beer I thought was a lot grosser than yeah. this one. Yeah, but this one's so sweet. Yeah. Mm. It's, it's pretty gross. Wow. It's But after taste wise right on the money for what they're going for. Very I mean, they nailed the flavor, but man, the chemical flavor right in the beginning yeah. was, is almost unbearable. But once you get past it, once, excellent. Once you get to the other side, gang. <laughs> Yeah. But I think the apple and the caramel are fighting to be dominant in, in this because it, it's both of those flavors are just right right there. Yeah. Yes. As Guy Fieri would say, it's pretty good. It's a cookie. And it has flavor. Right? Absolutely. Well, <laughs> anyway, people, thank you very much for sticking with us. Throughout this ridiculous review of Oreo cookies for the season, I hear rumors there's a there's an apple or a pumpkin spice coming soon, which I'm excited because I like pumpkin. Get the things. hell out of town! Mm -hmm. Pumpkin spice at this time. It's perfect timing. They are marketing geniuses over there at Nabisco. Yeah. All right, guys. Thank you very much. Thank you, John. Oh, for sticking my, my, through it. My pleasure. These cookies are gross. Go find them. Experience this for yourself. You have to. It's um, it's terrible. But thanks for everyone. Have a good day and subscribe and do what you need to. Thank you again. Goodbye, everyone. Goodbye. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's unfortunate. It's good. <laughs> Still good. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Fill a fake bottom candy reviews. Fill a fake bottom eats lots of candy. Fill a fake bottom candy reviews. Fill a bit of candy reviews. Eat candy. Fill a fake bottom candy. Lots of reviews. Fill a fake bottom reviews. Yeah, yeah. La da 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 Thanks for watching! Don't forget to subscribe!